Hi everyone, in this video, we will discuss difference between questionnaire versus schedule. Number of respondents, they had asked me, they said questionnaires and schedule is same thing, but look same, but they are technically not same. So today in this video, we would like to focus on difference between questionnaires and schedule. What are the advantages and disadvantages of questionnaire and schedule? So first of all, both the questionnaires and schedule are popularly used methods of collecting data in research survey. People, they are collecting data through questionnaires as well as through schedule also. But there are so many differences in between both these types. Questionnaire is generally sent through mail to informants to be answered as specified in a covering letter, but otherwise without further assistance from the sender. That means once you have sent your questionnaire through mail, right, now the respondent independently, he or she will fill this questionnaire and they will send back to you, right? So there is not any further assistance is required from the researcher, but schedule, Schedule is generally filled out by the researcher, research worker, or the enumerators who can interpret questions when necessary. So here is, suppose I want to fill one questionnaire through some, in, in some other language, might be from South Indian language or some other language, mm -hmm. right? So those, they, these people do not understand English. So we required one person who is the interpreter, right? Who can explain them. So we require a numerator, we require research worker. It is not possible respondents will send back this questionnaire through mail independently. So this one is the interpret questions that is in that case schedule is necessary. Then we come to the how we are going to collect data through questionnaire that would be relatively cheap and economical since we have to spend money only in preparing the questionnaire. And we are simply sending this questionnaire through mail to our respondents. So there is no field staff is required. But contrary, a schedule is relatively more expensive since considerably amount of money has to be spent in appointing enumerators and in importing training to them, as well as money is also spent in preparing schedules. So schedule is generally filled out by the research worker or the enumerators who can interpret questions when necessary. That means one question's meaning is not clear to the respondent. So this question would be elaborated or defined in a easy words, in a meaningful manner by the researcher. Next one is non-response is usually high in case of questionnaire. When the people do not understand or they do not respond and they are not returning back this questionnaire without any answering all the questions, and a bias, it may be bias due to non-response often remains indeterminate, indeterminate. And as against this, non-response is generally very low in case of schedule. Why? Because enumerator is sitting in front of them and they are filling these questionnaires and they are getting their answers of all the questions. And but there remains the danger of interviewer bias and cheating. It depends on a person who is taking all the response. He can become biased. He can become, he is doing cheating, right? That is the most important part in schedule. Next one is, in case of questionnaire, it is not always clear as to have replies. But in case of schedule, the identity of respondent is known. Because they, both of them, who is respondents and who is the research worker they are sitting together so identity is known but questionnaire method is likely to be very slow since many respondents do not return the questionnaire in time despite several reminders but in case of schedules the information is collected well in time as they are filled in by enumerators 
and uh, one more very important difference personal contact is generally not possible in case of the questionnaire method as questionnaires are sent to respondents by post who also in turn return the same by post but in case of schedule direct personal contact is established with respondents so questionnaire and schedule questionnaire method can be used only when respondents are literate and cooperative but in case of schedule the information can be gathered even when the respondents happen to be illiterate because same case i had already done when i had collected data in a village number of villages right that was related to my one of the research project and uh, those villagers they do not understand they were illiterate people they do not understand uh, all these questions meaning as well as they cannot read in english so ultimately we had hired some research workers they went personally to these villages and they have asked these questions to these villagers they had explained the meaning of all the questions and what could be the options right and after that whatever the villagers they had respond after that they had filled this questionnaire so this is the biggest difference between questionnaire and schedule and wider and more representative distribution of sample is possible under the questionnaire method but in respect of schedule there usually remains the difficulty in sending enumerators over a relatively wider area then the risk of collecting incomplete and wrong information is relatively more under the questionnaire method particularly when the people are unable to understand questions properly but in case of schedule the information collected is generally complete and accurate as enumerator can remove the difficulties if any faced by the respondent in correctly understanding the questions as a result the information collected through schedule is relatively more accurate than that obtained through questionnaires because a person who will not mark the response until or unless this questions meaning is not clear to the respondent but in the case of the questionnaire it is not possible because that is after this after sending this questionnaire to the respondents there is no role of the researcher then the the success of questionnaire method lies more on the quality of the questionnaire itself but in case of schedule much depends upon the honesty and competence of enumerators in order to attract the attention of respondents the physical appearance of the questionnaire must be quite attractive but this may not be so in case of schedules as they are to be filled in by enumerators and not by respondents so along with schedules observations method can also be used but such a thing is not possible while collecting data through questionnaires right when the respondent is filling that questionnaire and uh, those are the set of the questions so enumerator or the research workers they can observe that particular person also right whether they are smiling right and this is the correct answer and whether they are telling lie and they are filling wrong answers i think they can observe but in the case of the questionnaire it is not possible you can observe uh, you can you can observe um, questionnaires respondents feelings so this is all about your difference between questionnaire and schedule i hope this video would be helpful to you thank you so much keep watching